Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So this past weekend marked mine and my husband's first year wedding anniversary. We were married this time last year. And to celebrate, we went to the Grove Park Inn Resort and Spa in Asheville, North Carolina. We were given this trip as a gift. Um, so we started out on Saturday morning at the crack of dawn heading to Asheville. It's about an hour and 45 minutes away from us. We stayed the night on Saturday night and Saturday morning is when we had our facial appointments at the spa. The spa at the Grove Park Inn is fabulous. They had the most amazing facial I've ever had in my life. And I actually read somewhere that the spa at the Grove Park Inn was rated number 13 in the world. So when you get there, the spa is actually a separate building from the main building and you have to go down this winding tunnel of cave basically it's like got rock walls and it's got spa music playing it's so calm and so peaceful and they really take the peaceful aspect very seriously they make you turn off your phones no e-readers no tablets computers none of that is allowed in the spa period so unfortunately I wasn't able to get any footage from the spa I got some of these pictures offline and I kind of wanted to show you guys just how incredible it was. They have so many different pools, lap pools, mineral pools, cold pools, um, steam rooms, waterfalls, saunas, anything you can imagine it's in here in the spa. So afterwards we went up to the main building and had lunch on the patio which had the most amazing view of all the mountains and you can see the spa down there um, but yeah it was incredible. We should have taken a picture of the food before we ate it. After we had lunch, we went up to our room and checked in. We were so very blessed with the room that we got. We got um, one that was overlooking the whole patio, spa, mountains area that we had seen before. So that was amazing. After getting settled in for a little bit, we decided to open up our bottle of wine and take a walk around the hotel. It is about a hundred years old at this point and there's little pictures and plaques everywhere telling you a little bit about the history of it. The hotel has had a lot of famous celebrity and presidential guests, including Harry Houdini, Chris Daughtry, Michael Jordan, Helen Keller, um, and it's had about 10 presidents stay there. Next we went to dinner and we went out of the hotel for this. We went to a little taco place. It was so good. It was like a little um, hole in the wall restaurant about 10 minutes away from the hotel. And it was really cool because you could write on the napkins and slide them under the table glass.
they had these two main elevators that were kind of like hidden away in the rock wall and they actually were located behind the big fireplaces and the bellmen who operate each one have told us that that was actually to make sure that guests were not disturbed in the night. Another really cool story that I heard um, that I actually read was that a lady died by falling off of the fifth floor balcony. You can see it in this shot. We're on the third floor here. So two floors up, that one right in the middle. She fell off that balcony and actually died. Um, and they call her the pink lady because apparently some people still see her ghost every now and then. But I am happy to say that we did not. So the morning that we left, we ate at the famous breakfast buffet that they have there. And man, it was amazing. They had literally everything you could think of. So that is it guys. That's the end of this video. That was my romantic first anniversary weekend getaway. This has made me want to do a wedding series. I did a lot of my own stuff for my wedding. So since it's almost wedding season, I'm thinking about doing a wedding series. Um, but anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed and like, subscribe, and I'll see you on my next one. Bye.